to be back with you but before I get into this video I want to let you know that I am Love of Fragrance and on this particular channel I predominantly prescribe fragrances to you well however I recommend fragrances to you fragrances that I love fragrances that I have tested and fragrances that I highly admire and has developed an extensive love for and I just recommend them to you knowing for certain that you are going to love them because I try to bring you things that are relatable, things that you would love, things that you would appreciate, things that you would possibly class as signature fragrance. Many of them I classify as my signature fragrance and trust me, I bring to you predominantly designer fragrances because I love designer fragrances. But before I present this particular fragrance to you today, I would like to just give a shout out to two of my most loving, passionate individuals that I know in this world, Ms. Neek and Mr. Brian. I thank you guys so much for my B-Day gift and I'm so appreciative of it to the point where I just want to say, I'm going to show it to everybody, everybody, everybody. So here we go. <laughs> Bam! The name of this fragrance happened to be Hippodus Hippos. It's by none other than the top fragrance company in the world, Lancome. Yes, I love Lancome and I, apparently they knew it because they sent me a fragrance for my B-Day and I am so grateful. So let's get into this fragrance, honey. As you can see, the color of the box is purple. I've never heard of it before. I had never been exposed to it before. So they introduced me to something new. New, honey. And I love new. I really do. <laughs> Let's open this baby. It's packaged so beautiful. Look at there. It has a little gold seal right on the top of the box. And then it has another gold seal of tissue paper on top inside okay and here it goes here's the fragrance itself can you see it i think it's oh can you see it it's like a twisted diamond yeah look at it it's so exotic so elegant and beautiful all at the same time it's something that i highly admire honey they know my taste i love that Lux, lux, lux appearance that's applied to this container. Don't you think it looks luxurious? I know I do. And look on the top right there. It has like a diamond shaped cap that says Hypnose. The Y is silent, so the name of it's Hypnose. And you just pop it off. The cap, you just pop it off. And it has a very, very, very hardware designed spray nozzle here and let's see how it spruce out of here out of the container oh it flows very evenly look at that can you see it mm. see right there I'm gonna do it again so you can see oh, it spruce out so straight and forward and wide Mmm, mmm, look at that. So you can get the full capacity of the fragrance with just one sprout. You don't have to spritz it several times. Just one spritz and honey, you're good to go. Okay, Mrs. Hubnose, I'm going to hold you right here. And I'm, uh, okay, honey, I don't have to put this all the way up to my nose because I am very, very pleased with this aroma because it is reflective. It's so reflective. It's reflecting itself all throughout this room I'm in right now. Mmm. Potent, 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 potency. Potency everywhere. Mmm. But it has one of those. They're very distinctive aromas applied to it. 
I'm in love all over again. Thank you. This is me and Mr. Brian. My couple. <laughs> Thank you so much. Mm, I am so pleased. Wow. Let me tell you about this here hip hypnos. And yes, it's spelled N-O-S-E. Hypnos. <laughs> Let me tell you a little bit about this. This here happens to be an EDP. And it's by Lancome. And it was introduced somewhere in 2000. I'm not sure the exact number. I have to check it out for you. But also, the fragrance itself from the scent that I'm acquiring from this, it has an exceptional amount of freeness applied to it. It has an exceptional amount of um, floral notes applied to it. And it has a cherry berry aroma. A cherry berry aroma. The application of this here fragrance as a whole has to be evoking an alluring bouquet of fragrant floral notes. An exceptional amount of fragrant floral notes penetrating from this with an elevation of fruitiness and an elevation of green fragrant scented tones distributing themselves with this fragrance. And this scent itself Honey is exquisitely designed so beautifully. Lancome has put a very attractive aroma in this container until the point where it's undeniably lovely. Anyone that smells this fragrance on you exceptionally allured by the scent itself. In other words, it's attractive. It's inviting and it has that romantic appeal to it. It's scented with a light, delicate, yet evoking aroma that leaves the scent out. To some extent, it appears to be a little bit of tangy. So when you put it on, you have that elevation of floral notes. When you're from the top notes, an exquisite amount of floral notes which happens to be passive floral. But then, when you, it begins to dry down a little bit on you, you experience an exceptional amount of jasmine and berry blossoms elevating themselves. And then as you get accustomed to that particular note, the base notes subject themselves upward, alluringly, to the point where it transforms over to a, a scent, a veterinaire, and vanilla. Even though there isn't any veterinaire in this fragrance, it has that projection of the, an aroma of veterinaire, and it has an oriental flair of vanilla. But mm, there isn't any vanilla in it, but you have a squiff of unfluffed scented vanilla appearance projecting itself from this fragrance. It smells divine. It really does. But you know what it gives you? It has that purple tone, that purple scent. As a matter of fact, Miss Neek, her most favorite color is purple, which is probably why she sent me this fragrance. Come to think of it, every fragrance she gives me, her and Mr. Brian. For some reason, it's in purple in color. Come to think of it, but honey, I love it. I'm so grateful. Thank you, guys. This is a beautiful, loving, attractive aroma. And it has a sweet tone to it that gives you that appear, appeal of a romantic environment. First, I smell, it smells a little bit like linen to me. But I understand why it has that aroma because it gives you that sweet romantic, it gives you that sweet romantic atmospheric type vibe. Yes, and it's because the green notes in here give you that sensual reflection. So with the notes combining themselves and working together with the fruity notes Acting as a common mechanism in this particular fragrance, it gives you all of the attributes of romance. 
So it gives you that allure of romance which makes it even more sensual and more attractive to apply. And this fragrance happens to be a, a romantic fragrance which extends beyond which makes the scent exceptionally bright. It has a projectile applied to it where it's exquisitely designed, so appealing to the point where it has an exceptional amount of tangy, woody, powdery reflections within it. It appears to have all of those elements projecting themselves almost one after the other so intensely to the point where it appears that it's all working together all at one time but you have to really 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 be able to appreciate the notes in this scent to appreciate the aroma which it happens to be projecting because it's very attractive it's very appealing and more so than that is very romantic with a sensual vibe applied to it. So anyone that detects this fragrance on your body is going to find it very appealing. And I feel that this fragrance has been specifically designed for romance. That's the rapport that I attain from this fragrance. And I highly recommend that you attain a tester for this fragrance and apply this fragrance to determine as to whether or not it's appropriate for your body chemistry and whether or not you find it attractive for your type of style and whether or not you desire to invest in this particular fragrance because it has a very attractive aroma but it's designed for a specific occasion and that specific occasion happened to be, from my perspective, strictly romance. This is a romantic fragrance and it's strictly for romance. So I highly recommend anyone that's knowing, knowingly going to engage in a romantic occasion, this is the fragrance for you. It's beautiful to wear and it's attractively designed. It's lovely, lovely, lovely from every aspect. And I thank Lancome for this particular fragrance because this is a beauty in a bottle to me. Just like this bottle right here is so gorgeously designed, so has this fragrance been exquisitely designed. And it definitely happens to be in accordance with this container. And I highly love this fragrance. And I highly thank you, my dear loved ones. And I highly recommend this fragrance to everyone. It's a woman's fragrance. It's an EDP. And it has a longevity out of a rating of 10. It's a high 9.2. So, honey, what are there not to love? <laughs> Recommended with the most honest recommendation that I can possibly give to anyone regarding any fragrance love a fragrance love this fragrance and please invest in it you have a nice evening and i thank you again and remember the name is lancome hypnose lancome hypnose check it out have a beautiful day bye